from Apple Valley News Now. First alert weather with Chief Meteorologist Josh Colbreth. Welcome back to Good Morning Northwest. Today is going to be seasonal. It's going to be sunny. We'll have highs that will end up being in the 80s. So just a beautiful start to the work week. And then for tonight, Overnight low is going to drop off into the 50s and 60s. Most of us should be dry, could have maybe a shower or two up in the Cascades. Winds will start to pick up in the Kittitas Valley, gusting upwards of 20 miles per hour, and that will definitely get exacerbated into tomorrow. Let's show you that with Futurecast, and uh, you can see as we put this in motion, there's going to be a couple different areas and, and chances for showers for tomorrow. The first time frame being around lunchtime in the foothills could have a light shower too but then into the p.m. hours there's a slightly better chance of some showers maybe even some thunderstorms up in the cascades so and that's going to be one impact from tomorrow but a much bigger impact is going to be from the winds and the temperatures as this cold front is going to move through that's going to pick up our winds and we do have that wind advisory in place for the Kittitas Valley from 9 to 9 and then for the lower Columbia Basin from 11 a.m. to 9 p.m. As winds in these areas could gust between 25 to 45 miles per hour, the strongest wind gust easily being in the Kittitas Valley. And again, like I said, the other impact being our temperatures going way down, dropping back into more of that fall-like territory for Tuesday and Wednesday. But look at this. We, we throw it in a reverse as we head into the weekend as we'll be up into the mid-90s, placing us at about 5 to 10 degrees degrees above average for this time of the year. So it is going to be a very summer like Labor Day weekend. We're going to dry things out as we head into the weekend. So it's looking like um, I, I think I think a lot of people are going to be pretty happy with that weekend forecast, especially since it's the end of summer. Here is the seven day forecast for the Tri Cities we will be dipping into the fall like weather for Tuesday and Wednesday, but mid 90s again as soon as this weekend. For Yakima, how about some lows maybe dropping into the 30s for tomorrow night, but then a quick turnaround as uh, we'll, we'll turn summer like again by the weekend. Then for Hermiston, winds picking up and highs going down for Tuesday, staying sunny and warming back up during the back half of the week. And then for Walla Walla, a small shower chance for tomorrow, dry for the rest of the forecast period with highs returning to the 90s by Friday.